Did you click this video because of the thumbnail or because of the headline and thought to yourself, let's see what this moron has for shortcuts to me to help me to get inside the pants of the ladies. It is exactly your lazy ass that needs to watch this video. Because there are no shortcuts, there is no miracle magic juice that will drop the panties of the ladies. It is not the fragrance that makes you sexy, it is you that makes the fragrance sexy. So when you think about that, every fragrance has the potential of being a panty dropper. A fragrance can ever only be the sherry on the cake. And you, my friend, you are the cake. But to be that delicious, irresistible cake, there are a lot of boxes to tick. Because it's all about sending out signals and impressions just a sherry doesn't look anything exciting, but when you put that sherry on the cake, both cake and sherry guts. The base of the cake, you, has to be manners and hygiene and personality. Now, I can't help you with your manners and hygiene. I can't help you with your overall personality either. But with the sherry on the cake, it can improve your self-esteem. It can get you to feel more comfortable and relaxed. That leads to improve your confidence. Now we all know that the right amount of confidence is sexy. Not too little like the gray little mouse in the corner and not too much either that becomes a cocky confidence. Just a right amount. To achieve that there are some ground rules to think about. Time, place, occasion and outfit. Because wearing ultra male to the office or school is gonna send out signals that you are desperate. You are in desperation of attention or that you're trying to hide a bad body odor. Why did I mention ultra male? Well, because most of the time when I watch those videos, those sexy fragrance videos, those panty dropping videos, it most of the times all those sweet, loud and head turning fragrances that are mentioned. And me personally, I think those kind of scents are most for going out, clubbing scents and stuff like that. But is that really the only time you want to impress a lady? You might have a school crush, you might have a co-worker, you might have a cashier at your local store or a barista where you go and pick up your daily coffee. So that is what we're gonna talk a little bit about today. How to optimize your chances with your scent, together with your outfit, with the signals and impressions you want to send out. But take this for what it is, just a subjective guideline. There is no rules, you obviously wear whatever you want, whenever you want, wherever you want. If it is possible, I insert some minimis around here with clothes, just to give some kind of inspiration. So it's just inspiration for you to optimize your clothing and your fragrances to optimize the signals and impressions you want to send out. So let's get into the scents. Hi, my name is Tim. All welcome to another edition of Smelly Sweet. And the first fragrance out is Leighton from Parfum de Mali. I know I'm starting with the most obvious one, Leighton. We have seen it in a bunch of videos like this but it is impossible to not include it in a video like this. But I wouldn't recommend you to wear it to the office or school because it might send out the signal of desperation. However, I think it works perfectly for a day out of the town, walking about, going for a shopping trip to the mall or something like that with a semi casual look. It obviously also works as a clubbing, pub round scent, but then you will go for more of a party look, I guess. And it, it just works for those occasions. It will have the birds flocking around you like flies around a pile of shit. And the signals and impressions it sends out on these occasions is that you're a modern man, you never say no to an adventure and you're always up for a good time. So other attention grabbers that sends out the same signals is Saw Juan Black, Serge of Naxos, Niche Roll Patchouli TB, Usain Laurent, Bleu Electrique from the La Nuit de l'Homme Line. If you're a guy that prefer more kind of a summary vibing fragrances, some good attention grabbers is Aqua di Gio Profumo and Fragrance du Bois Oud Bleu Intense. However, this is pretty weak, but in the summertime it does shine. Next fragrance up is Paralum. EDT. 
This one is for the school or office. Or when you have a break you're running down to pick up a coffee and you know you're gonna bump into a lady you want to impress. But in this case the scent and the combination of clothes is crucial for the signals you want to send out. This soapy iris, yes iris I know but it is the one that goes in the soapy direction. It's gonna make you smell clean but also warm and soft from an amber and sandalwood in the base. Now if you combine this with some light grey pants, a crisp white shirt, you're gonna smell clean, look crisp. The signals you will send out is that you are ambitious and successful yet warm and welcoming. And you can also dress it down a bit. So for, for casual wearing or if you're in school some dark blue denim jeans and a crisp white t-shirt will have the same effect. However this sadly only projects for two hours. So if you're able to have the bottle in your desk or bring a decant with you just reapply top up with two or three sprays every second hour or if you're that well aware that in 20 minutes the risk is that I'm gonna bump into this girl or lady just top off with one or two sprays at that time. It will leave the lady dreaming of you as this successful almost untouchable man. So when you're finally ready to ask her out she is going to be overwhelmed and she's going to be so flattered that she just simply can't say no. A couple of other fragrances that would work for these occasions as well is Chanel Platinum Egoist and niche for all pineapple oak and any Aventus inspired fragrance. But here you can go with a little bit more darker clothes, you can be a little bit more colorful but it will have the same effect and leave the women dreaming of you as a successful man. But what if you're a man that simply prefers a little bit more wintry kind of scents than these summerish kind of scents? Well Ganymede from Marc Antoine Barreau will do the same thing. It smells of successful, it smells of futuristic and yes it will leave the ladies dream of you as a very ambitious and successful man. And if you go to school or just are on a little bit of a tighter bar budget Eau Saint Laurent L'Homme Eau de Parfum works perfectly well. A little bit more woody and aromatic compared to the EDT that is a little bit more fresh spicy. However not the best longevity on this one so as usual bring a decant, top it up every 3-4 hours and you're good to go. Are you ready to ask her out on a date yet? You got her attention with Leighton and the other attention grabbers. You got to impress her with your Prada Loom and your Ganymede for the office or school. So now it's just time to put the question out there. Would you like to go on a date with me? And normally when we talk about date night scents on Freycon we talk about those sweet cozy fragrances, those warm fragrances such as Rojas Moustache EDP or Ucelon Tuxedo or Amani Strong With You Intensely. But facts is that most women prefer when the man smells fresh. And you might, your first date might be a lunch, coffee or a picnic in the summertime rather than a dinner and a cinema in the evening. And by the way cinema dates are the worst kind because you can't get to know each other. You can't talk to each other and it also shows a proof of lack of imagination. So if you are going for a lunch or a coffee in the afternoon in the summertime in a hot day go with Chanel Allure Edition Blanche. It is a safe bet. I've never seen a girl trying this fragrance and don't go oh this smells nice. So in matter of fact when she gets a whiff of you when you wear this to the first date she might just slip off her share. I don't know what it is with this fragrance but the combination of lemon and vanilla just seems to do the trick with the ladies. But when you wear this one it's not that important which clothes you wear. It's more important to dress off the location, time of the day, activity and stuff like that because this fragrance still will send out the signals that you're a positive person with a good energy and a combination of sandalwood, tonka, vanilla will send out the signals that you have a good heart, a sweet heart. A couple of other fragrances that works for daytime, summertime, dates are these. Creed's Royal Water. Now I can't really recommend anybody to buy this fragrance and that is something I will talk about in an upcoming video. All the fragrance brands milking us but this one smells of class but in a humble way. So the signals it will send is that you have class but you keep your feet grounded. Dior Homme Sport 2021. It is the perfect 
fragrance for a date with activities. Maybe you go for a bowling, maybe you go for a bike ride in the mountain, whatever. You go for a walk in the summertime. It's just perfect because when your body temperature gets heated, this freaking juice just blooms. And it will send out the signals that you are a sporty, active, active guy that doesn't like to sit still. But now it is time to look at the date nights. You might go to a fancy restaurant. Maybe you have invited her to come home for you for dinner. And in those cases, you just can't come in denim and t-shirt. A dress code is definitely a little bit more. Surge of Ivory Root and Spice Bomb Extreme. But I'm gonna focus a little bit more on Ivory Root. Now this is pure class. It has some spices, it has some basil and it has some sandalwood. I also pick up a edgy vanilla in this one. Now the signals it will send out is that you have a spicy edge, but that you can provide security and stability for the lady. And fact is that that is something many ladies appreciate in a man, a stable man that provides security. But with the spicy edge in that, this one, it will leave the ladies not taking you for granted. Spice Boom Extreme does the same thing, but not in as a sophisticated way as Ivory Root does. Now, this may be turned out to be a long video, but as I said in the beginning of this video, there are no shortcuts to win a lady's heart. But if, it, but if it is one night stand you're going for, go with one of the attention grabbers. But seriously, if it is one night stand you're going for, your fragrance doesn't matter as long as you don't smell bad. If the ladies want to fuck you, she is going to fuck you. Whatever fragrance you are wearing. A woman's mind is complicated. I don't ask me how they pick out their victims for one night stands. We men, we are a little bit more easy. If we see melons, big or small, if we see a peach, big or small, we just go, wow, and we are ready to roll. But keep in mind that sometimes one night stands turns into a relationship, becomes a second night stand, becomes a regular thing, turns into a relationship. And remember what I said, a woman's mind is tricky because at this stage, whatever you say to the woman, she will remember forever. And when you least expect it, that comes out of her mouth, jumps up and bites you in the ass. That was all for today, my friends. I hope you enjoyed this video. For you guys who stayed this long, thank you very much. For you guys who still hates my guts, piss off. What are you doing here? The rest of you, see you around.